Hi, my name is Charlie. Hi, my name is Jasmine. And we're here in Whitney with Oxford Motor Club doing a navigational scatter rally. So today I've brought along my girlfriend Jazz and she's going to do some navigating for me. So scatter rallies are a grass route form of motorsport and it's done on the public highway in your very standard road car. This is a navigational scatter rally with elements of a scavenger hunt. When participants get given points to plot, Teams are made up of a driver and a navigator, but additionally, passengers are often permitted. All teams must determine their own route and reach the various points necessary within the time limit. These events are placed on public roads. Teams must stick to the speed limit and make sure they're back for the stated time. And they are a great way to learn basic navigational techniques. So before the event, you need to register to the eligible club and sign up for your free Motorsport UK RS Clubman license. An upgrade is available where you can enhance benefits as such as physical license, lanyard and a car sticker. Pre-event, make sure you read the regulations and it will tell you information such as the correct map you need to buy, plus any specialist equipment you will need. So we're on a tight time limit here. Jazz has got all the clues. We're now plotting the map. We've been given this thing called the Basic Roma. I've never seen one of these before, but it helps us plot the map and it's really specific. So we've been given an eight figure grid reference and this thing is super helpful to get precise readings off the map. So to be quite honest, a lot of this is going over my head, but luckily it's mostly about the navigation. I'm just the driver, so I get told where to go, but she'll be doing all the main hard work at this event. So you need to form a team. You need a driver and a navigator so you can team up with whoever you want and you decide if you want to navigate or if you want to drive. If you're a total beginner, it's a good idea to sit down and practice plotting on a map. So as soon as you tie up to the event, you need to go sign on. So you need to go find an official and sign all the necessary paperwork. Once you've signed on, you'll receive map points. You'll then need to plot the map points to decide your route. There's a set time to plot and visit as many points as possible and choose your route to the finish, ensuring that you're not late. Take as much time needed when you're starting out and don't be put off by the experienced crews heading off before you. And if you get stuck, the organisers are always there to help and sometimes provide total beginners with pre-marked maps. So before you head off, there's a few things you need. A charged smartphone and your Motorsport UK RS Clubman licence. So the best thing about streetcar is that you can literally turn up in your everyday road car just like this Volvo Estate. So all you need is a map and we've plotted it inside, had a lovely coffee and now we're ready to head off. So we're going east and we'll try and find a windmill, I think. A windmill? Yeah, I think so. So we've got a few other scavenger hunt ones that are pictures must include a team member. So we've got to get the lowest price of eggs, right. a live sheep, a live sheet? A train. So we've got to get okay. a photo. Right, so we have to get our photography so keep, skills going. Yeah, keep an eye out. That's it, there? Yeah. We've got to go closer because we need to see what animal's on top. So Jazz, I might be mistaken, but that is definitely a cow on top of there. Yeah, definitely. I've seen one of them before. When you start one of these events, it is crucial to make sure that you've got fuel in your car. We're on a tight schedule right now and I'm wasting valuable time. I should have been more prepared. I don't want too much fuel in race weight, you know? That's it, perfect. And the penny, that will help. Don't forget the shake. Oh wait, oh. eggs! <laughs> nice! Oh mate, quick, right, we've got to get a photo. You ready? Yeah. Yeah, nice. Geese eggs, one pound. Perfect, cheap, bargain, let's go. Yeah, we've got one side. Because it looks like a bottle. Oh, there it is, there it is. Let's go is read it. Like one, though? Perfect, so that is the path, the bridal way to two. Stonefield. That says two, so two, two miles. miles, yeah. Oh yeah, right. Perfect, all Perfect. right, let's, let's find go. the next one. Right, so Jazz, I think we've done really well. We've done six points and I mean, we've got to get to the pub in less than half an hour. I'm gonna leave the decision to you. Are we gonna do another one or are we just gonna head straight there? Let's head straight to the pub. Yeah? Yeah, let's go. Right, to the pub. So we have just finished, we've arrived at the pub, which is the last zone and just in time as well. So how do you think we did? Yeah, I think we did good. We got a few few points, didn't we? Yeah, we only went the wrong way once or twice. Yeah, once or twice, that doesn't matter. Should we go, go hand our scores in? Yeah. It's really tested us to the absolute limits in both <laughs> our relationship and our driving and navigational skills. Mine but were good. Yours were fantastic, yeah. really good. 
I'm not convinced that we've won, but we've had a, a brilliant time doing it. And it's such an amazing, accessible way to get into motorsport with your friends, your family, your girlfriends. And it's a welcoming group. Everybody was so lovely. And we get to meet at a pub at the end for a nice bit of social, so it's super fun. So if you want to get involved, head over to streetcarmotorsportuk.com and sign up to one of these events for yourself because we've had such a blast.